Greetings, Vince Daniels here. I have, oh, as you probably have guessed, I've been trying to get the uh, YouTube subtitler thing to work. It hasn't. Uh, I've tried all of their suggestions, read their instructions, and when I go to add annotations, I can see the annotations and the timing quite nicely. I see the captions and subtitles. Now watch what happens. Get a totally different UI. I have to upload something. Why can't I use the annotation menu that shows me where where an object appears in time? I can move that object in time and add my subtitles here. Why do I need to upload something if I can just add them in this area? And it's more, more more to the point, this UI doesn't make any sense really if you could just use uh, it's okay, continue. if you just use this UI because the biggest problem frankly with using this this mess is that the timing is just not intuitive whereas having a click and drag bar it gives you much more control over the time especially if you zoom in look at that you get microseconds here tenths of a second you try to do that here and you're clicking 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 that's a pain in the rear why not drag and drop people come on this is uh, especially this being able to zoom in zoom out where you want your captions uh, yeah I'd rather use this user, user interface than this one this one frankly sucks please YouTube subtitler people use what you got it's right here you got a nice zoom you can add text right in here be nice if I could just double click and add the text but it doesn't work that way um, appreciate your time and I really hope you fix this terrible UI